Alright gamers, welcome back to GTA Vice City, the definitive edition. My name is Invoyance, and today, going back to Interglobal Films here, gotta keep working on promoting this movie, so uh, go to the studio next mission here, Martha's Mugshot. Okay, what's the problem now? Shh. After his close encounter with the Nympho invaders, our hero finds himself unable to think of anything but this huge phallic oh, yeah. mountain. And that's when I want to do the scene with the vat of mashed potatoes, but then I'll we... Don't give uh... a crap about that! Just keep going, keep going. You mentioned something about some legal problem oh, on the yeah. phone. Congressman Alex Shrub has jumped on the pre-election bandwagon. He's going after the Puritan vote. Rumors are he's going to support measures to restrict, shall we say, the more fleshy oh, yeah. aspects of this nation's mm -hmm. great entertainment oh, yeah. industry. Okay, all right. Okay. Candy, okay, you know Shrub. Okay, you guys get up to anything Bob. kinky? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. All right, then. Oh, yeah. Okay. Right. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Got that. Was that part of the, uh, was she talking to? Hey, I can never tell. Anyway, you're probably best following her after the shoot. See if she'll lead you to their new love nest. You got a camera? Yeah, get him a camera. All right, so basically the uh, goal here is that we have to follow Candy to uh, the sh uh, to the meetup with uh, Congressman Shrub and then uh, snap a picture so that we can fuck up his election. So basically, um, yeah, that's, that's really it. <laughs> that's really it. Um, because we have to um, try to ruin the vote because he's trying to restrict the porn industry. And so that obviously isn't good for our movies. Um, so gotta wait for candy. This takes fucking forever because she decides to walk like a goddamn sloth. Um, there she, oh, she decided to run. Look at that. So we gotta follow the stretch. It doesn't matter if we're close or not. It doesn't mean shit. Um, so we can be real right behind follow her the entire way to uh, Alex Schroeber. Who, you know, is a prick anyway. You know, he cheats on his wife with candy. And, you know. U.S. politics, baby. <laughs> I don't know how else to describe it. So, anyway, we gotta snap the picture. That's the big thing. Catch him, ruin his vote, so that he doesn't have a chance to fuck up the uh, industry for us, so. It's like, it's not a close drive to where they're going, but it's also not far. I think it's like that hotel right there, I believe, right there. I don't remember. Maybe it's this one. I don't know. We're watching however long this goes anyway, so. Nothing new. We'll know in a second. I think it is this one, though. This one, or is it the uh, Vice Point one that's uh, right there? Can't read it. What? Ding! Right, <laughs> landing Vice Point. Standing Vice Point. Okay. I actually have never noticed that before. Hey. So he's weird, uh, but that's okay. I don't knock people for their kink. So he had three good blackmail photos. Uh, so the Chariot Hotel, that's where we're at right here, uh, should provide an ideal photo grabbing location. There's a side door you can access the hotel, considering I went through the, uh, uh, tried to go through the front door. Now I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a little, little, uh, little hint here uh, for the gamers back home. 
Uh, gonna want to escape real quick, so I'm just gonna put the car in a position where we can move. So we're gonna climb up the uh, hotel so that we can get to a good view so that we can see the rooftop that Candy and uh, Shrub are on. So up here now. So there they are. We gotta get three photos. Let's zoom in all the way. Obviously, he's in his uh, he's in his uh, interesting garb there. There's one, there's two, and a third. Someone's watching. How kinky! So we got to get back to the porn studio with the film. Unfortunately, uh, the government is on to us, so we got to deal with that. So got a five star one level. That's great. Uh, I'm gonna take like every stairwell um, so we can shoot. Cause, give me that camera. As you hear. It's no joke, shithead. Still waiting to see him. There they are. Oh, we can't shoot. The feds onto us. Our fed boy. Alright, we got them. Alright, well, I hear the police car is already smashing my car up, trying to get into this uh, alley. Uh, that's not what I heard. Anyway, we gotta get uh, out of here. We've had this wanted level before. We did the same thing. We grabbed that star, and then, uh, I was gonna say, the pain spray is real close. I'm just gonna... Oh, hello. Damn it. Oh no, he rolled me back over. Oh, okay, we're frick now. I'm on fire. Interesting. Interesting. I thought there was a star in here. If I have to take a damn helicopter, I will. I think that's what's gonna happen. <laughs> this is insane. I'm down for it, though. Gotta take the helicopter. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I didn't pull up in time. Oh god. That's okay. How do I fly this thing? It doesn't work in the way I thought it would. Alright, well. We gotta get out anyway. Let's grab this car here. Take it down the road to the pay and spray. Oh, they got me. Almost immediately here. Where's the damn. Oh, I went the wrong way. It was right there. What was I thinking? Alright, that's okay. Oh god. Can I back in here real quick? It'd be great if I could. There we go, there we go. Everything's fine. Everything's great. Everything's wonderful. <laughs> Not really, but, you know, it's what it is. Um, oh, I just bumped a car. Okay, good. It wasn't a police car. Alright, well, we uh, lost the wanted level for the time being. Gotta be a good boy now. Couldn't turn off the damn radio to save my fucking life, so we got, like, snippets of four different radio stations, so... If you needed help deciding what station to listen to this weekend, uh, I'm your guy. <laughs> so we got the photos of Candy with uh, Alex Shrub there, so can ruin his campaign real quick. That's no problem, that was the goal. So, stop back at the uh, film studio, give it to Steve. Oh, what? Oh, they're after me. The feds. Tough shit, fed boy. Blocking me in. Blocking me in at my movie studio. Where do you get off? I'll tell you, there's a lot of people that get off here at this movie studio, but uh, that's another story. Alright, well, mission complete. That's pretty epic. Uh, we have some more missions to do here before this becomes an asset, so, of course, there's the uh, good old moon landing set. <laughs> uh, but anyway, we'll get into that in just a bit. Alright, so back here at the D studio at Interglobal. Get into the next mission here. It is G Spotlight. I'm sorry, but I just can't swallow oh, this right on, now. come on, darling. He's hung like a sperm whale, for pity's sake. How can you not feel the part? But Stevie... 
That was my star director. Oh, man, the struggle between mm. the artistic integrity and the humping, pumping action continues unabated. Mm. And before you ask, <laughs> yes, all four videos will be released mm. by their... Honey, can you please keep the Andacon and the shoddy cost more per hour than you do? Oh, sorry, Steve. I was thinking, we need some kind of big stunt to really promote the launch. Mm. Something that will make a real impact on this city. You got any ideas? No. Mm. Well, in the old days, they used to have gala events, stars, limos, the night sky crisscross with searchlights. Searchlights. I got an idea. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, little sequin numbers and the limos. Uh, oh, mm. premieres. Oh, yes, uh, ma'am. Of course, yeah. ma'am. And the press and the barrage of lights. So we got to go downtown and adjust the spotlight on top of the building. So... We gotta take this bike, a fast bike. We need to get to rooftop buildings. There should be a lift into one in the upper offices. So uh, it gets pretty wild in here. Um, it's I, it's honestly it, this is a difficult mission because you can fuck up a lot, and there's a time limit. You got to do it by a certain time. As you see, I started the mission in the morning, and now it's 17:30 ish. So we gotta go to the offices. Hopefully, I won't screw up much or at all. Uh, but we gotta go to the office so that we can get a height advantage because we're basically gonna be climbing different rooftops that are inaccessible from stairwells and stuff, so. Um, go up. Fuck. Okay. Sorry. Uh, go all the way up to the uh, area here, so. It's down here. The camera's not really that helpful, to be completely honest, so. The stairs will lead around to a lower office. Okay, sorry, I was adjusting my ear again. Sorry for the noises. So, climb up the stairs here with the bike. I will drive into the offices down here. Nobody's gonna bat an eye, so I'll go drive into the elevator, you know, mm, casually. Really <laughs> Nobody's saying a word curse the guy farts or maybe she farted maybe Tommy farted probably Tommy somebody well anyway now we're up here so we got to return to the office if we fall so we're gonna get a uh, good vantage to smash through the window to start the car she have until 7 a.m. before it gets too light to get there unseen the pink markers will show you which building to jump to next so yeah, it's pretty difficult. We have until 7 a.m., which is 11 minutes of gaming, so... Oh, I didn't mean to hit the guy. That might have fucked it up. I think we'll make it. Yeah, we made it. Alright. <laughs> I hurt myself, but... We got a unique stunt bonus, uh, so... $200 to help pay for that, uh, for that bruise I got. Anyway, so next building we gotta jump to. Down here, so we'll do that. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Another stunt bonus, so we have more money to save. So, as you see, I just wish you could, like, actually see, you know. That next one. Oh, okay, I'm glad I stopped when I did. So, we'll, uh, just keep going. Hopefully we'll have enough on me. I don't think I do. I'm a na I'm a, such a downer with this shit, dude. Oh, oh, we made it. Okay. <laughs> Can I get up here with this? No. Grab the health anyway, real quick. Get back up to 100. Anyway, we gotta keep moving here. Like I said, hopefully I don't die or this takes too long. I really don't want it to. This mission, I've... I don't think I've ever actually failed this mission. It's just that, you know, oh, I missed. Oh, I just made it. You believe this shit? Anyway, as I was saying, I don't think I've ever actually failed this mission. I think I've just had to restart numerous times where it wasn't uh, entertaining anymore. It was tedious. Honestly, I kind of hate when video games are tedious. I'm just trying to game. Oh, shit. <laughs> I thought I was going to face plant. Either way, we would have been on the building, so that's okay. It's gonna get darker from here because it's uh, night time, so we gotta get all the way over. Okay, it's not as bad as I thought it was. So now we see where the next one is. It's probably the best bike to have. Oh, it's close. 
Alright, where's the next one? This way. The, uh, transmitter on it. Ooh, we made it over. That's good. So, this bridge is open now, so, uh, if we fall, we can take that bridge. So return to the ladder if you need access to the rooftops again. So I'm gonna get off real quick, so we can grab this, uh, body armor pickup. Be nice. So I see my, uh, see my bike starting to smoke a little bit more. Probably not a good thing, but, uh, hopefully I think we're almost done. I don't know if that's a halfway marker because of the thing, but... Anyway, we'll, uh, get over to this one. Next one here. Shit, barely m Oh, fuck. That was scary. Barely made that one. <laughs> that almost went off the edge. Alright, well, let's line this one up so we don't fuck it up. Stress level's high in this mission, let's just say that. Okay. Probably should have taken a little bit more product er, productivity or uh, risk assessment, if you will. Shaft hot dog, the taste of a real man's meat. Right. <laughs> we'll just get over this one real quick, too. I think this is the final one right here. Up the stairs. Back up here real quick. Ooh, it's close. I'll get on this one. Ooh, that's too much, too much, too much, too much. All right. Um, okay, it's gonna open another staircase for us, so if we fall again, we'll be okay. I was wondering why the game took control error. I was like, what the hell? Oh, okay, we, we made it. So now I just gotta do the thing with the uh, searchlight here. film studio asset is completed now that we got the big advertisement there on the building for uh, the movie so it'll generate seven thousand dollars which is real nice nice chunk of change for us especially since our uh complete the mission g spotlight without falling to the rooftop i am a god at this video game are i <laughs> uh that might actually be the first time i never fucked anything up so i uh, call it luck call it uh we'll call it luck of the recording because uh clearly all eyes on me i I, sh I shine the spotlight. Ow. Oh, we got a phone call real quick, too. Tommy, Paolo here, two Paso Amigos. What do you want, Paul? I don't want any fake label clothes. Very funny, mate, but you know I don't touch bank gear. No, I was just calling to see if I can get a part in one of your movies. Back in England, I did a lot of blue stuff, mate. I'm packing more weight than you, my son. Paul, well, thanks for the offer. I'll bear that in mind. Seriously, don't forget about me. I'll fall up down for you. That's what I'm trying to forget about. So Paul wants in on one of the movies, and he's not going to get it, so... <laughs> anyway, uh, we're going to have to go collect some money, because I don't have money to be buying another asset, so... I'll be back in just a minute. Alright, so I ended up scrounging up uh, $70,000 here. Because uh, that's how much we needed to... Uh, what are y'all shooting at right now? Uh, but that's what we needed to get the next asset here, so... Uh, there's two more assets to get. There's this, uh, there's a one we're about to buy, uh, the print works, and then there is, uh, one more very expensive one that, uh, is gonna take some doing. So hopefully, uh, for the asset missions for the print works here, hopefully the, uh, payouts are good so I don't have to spend all day running around the city collecting my asset money. Which is what I just spent probably a good two, uh, fifteen minutes? I'm way off on where I'm, where I'm headed. Go down the sewer grade, I guess. I'm trying to go to the print works. I, I couldn't tell if I couldn't remember if it's Little Haiti entrance or Little Havana. It's Little Havana here, so so go over by the print works here for seventy thousand. So print works purchased for seventy thousand, which is as it said. Uh, so there's a few missions we can do. We'll start the first one here. All right, spilling the beans.
Mr. Vassetti? Hey, you bought the old print works? Yeah, my old man used to work on these. I used to spend the evenings with him cleaning the rollers. I was going to follow him in his trade, but I lived a different life. You planning on selling the old machinery? Breaking it down? I'm thinking we might print something. A newspaper, a magazine. Oh, crap, Sonny. Low-grade crap. I've always fancied printing money. It ain't too hard. You know, I've been doing it on a small scale for years. Really? Sure. But we need some good quality plates. Of course. There's a counterfeiting syndicate already operating in Florida. A syndicate? Yeah, with just rumors is all I've heard. I know a man who's good with rumors. So you can use the coffin cab to take us to destination instead of driving. It'll cost us nine bucks. So, I don't think we have to take the cab. Maybe we do? Yeah, let's take the cab. Fuck it. It's my own cab after all. Oh, <laughs> that's not what I wanted to do. I'm sorry. Get back to your job. Alright, well, anyway. Uh, so, gotta go see Kent because obviously he knows everything and he's, you know, he's... As uh, Ken described, you know, as knows everybody. What, what, what's the line? His nose is so far up Vice City's ass that if anybody knows where, on this case, counterfeit bill syndicates are, it's this guy. So, uh, so we met Ernest there. He's the the guy in charge of the print works, and uh, nice nice guy. Uh, Obviously, he's a little crooked, too, and the fact that he likes to make, uh, counterfeit... Uh, why'd you run into me? Uh, he ran into me. You all saw that. But, uh, Ernest makes, uh, counterfeit money, which, you know, sounds great to us. So, uh, gonna have the counterfeit money. So we gotta stop here at the Malibu so we can go talk to Kent, per usual, when we need to hear something. Look at the arse on that. Oh, Alright girls, you're lost mate, innit? Alright, me old China! That's hanging! What do you know about counterfeiting? Oh, I'm fine, Paul. How about you? <coughs> oh, alright, alright, alright. You obviously a busy man. All I know about Dodgy Reddies is to try and supply the plates. Ah, oh, fuck! They've got a shipping company down the docks. Ah, uh, uh, the boss man would know when the plates are coming in next. Thanks, Paul. What's the matter with you, you maniac? Give me another drink, lively. So we gotta go to the Chartered Libertine Lines boat at the docks, so... Uh, shipping officer will have the information that is required, so... Getting in there is kind of difficult, because, uh, there's gamers with guns and shit, so... Uh, but we'll, we'll figure that out, we'll see this in action, so... Uh, we gotta get to our docks, funny enough, you know, the ones that we own. Um, but it is for everybody, if I'm not mistaken. It's pointing me in a weird direction, but it, yeah, I figured it auto, it would correct itself. So, I think it wanted me to take the one bridge that's close to it, and you don't have to go through Starfish Island for, but... I always use Starfish Island as like a midway point. Also. You know, we live there, so we gotta get in here and uh, get the plates. So, you know, think about it. You got counterfeit business that you know is gonna be very cautious about everything. So we gotta get on the boat here. So I'll do that. Might as well. We should have a gun out here. Yep. Been spotted already. Kind of expected such. Just use the M4, I guess. How that guy just run past me for? So we need uh, need to get higher, clearly. So stairs, very nice. Can't see anybody there, but hear them shooting. They get them both? No. Up oh, the alarm went off. Uh oh. Just making sure there wasn't another. 
I have less than a thousand dollars on me right now. Just want to make sure there's not anybody sneaking up on moi. Grab the, uh, oh hello. Make sure there's nobody else. Trying to see here. Alright, let's, uh, get inside here. You gotta get the information back to the print works, so gotta hurry along now. Gotta get off the boat first. Then we gotta go see Ernest. Cause he's gonna be the one using these uh, plates that we stole, so. There's a lot of guys here, shit. They keep despawning in front of me, but I don't know who's who. I'm poor as shit, I'm gonna take every dollar I see on the ground. I don't know if there's a if there's a stealth way you can do this mission, to be completely, I have no idea. It's probably overkill to be using this weapon, I probably should have just been using the SMG, because it would take care of them as long as I get like a nice headshot. That's whatever, it's a little, little late. I don't know who that was shooting at me, but nonetheless I'm gonna... Oh, you know what? It doesn't really matter, but... There is this uh, armor pickup, so now I got a hundred armor again. So anyway, we're gonna head over to the print works. You know the use. Oh, okay. I forgot I have a wanted level. <laughs> That's fine. Okay. I'm sorry. All we gotta do is just get there, and I think we're home free, so... Get out. And, uh, we did that, so... Uh, there's still some more missions to do for the print works. We're gonna get to that next time, as we got, uh, just a few more asset things to do here. Uh, but that's gonna do it for this episode of Vice City, the Definitive Edition. Uh, we'll get to more, I, I always say the same thing, I accidentally repeat myself, but get to more Printworks missions then, but till then, thanks for watching, and more than ever, take care.